Welcome to Zion's podcast, Casting for Christ. We are back. We come to you from our studio at Zion Lutheran Church in Casterville. I'm your host, Pastor Greg. I don't have any news and notes today. Just ask all you, all you members to see our daily emails Tuesdays through Fridays, and we have uh, news and notes in those. And that brings us to our trivia question this morning, which is, uh, I can give you a hint, it's coming from the Old Testament. Finish the following sentence from Scripture. As for me and my house, we'll get back to the answer to the remainder of that sentence after our devotion this morning. Our devotion comes to us from Dr. Kerry Bow at Lutheran Hour Ministries, and it's entitled Responsibility, based on Matthew chapter 2, verses 13 through 15a, which reads, Now, when they had departed, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream, and said, Rise, Take the child and his mother and flee to Egypt and remain there until I tell you, for Herod is about to search for the child to destroy him. And he rose and took the child and his mother by night and departed to Egypt and remained there until after the death of Herod. Look how much trust God put in Joseph. God trusted him with Jesus' safety. He spoke to him in a dream to warn him about Herod's plans, and Joseph listened. He got Jesus and Mary safely out of the country and took care of them there until it was safe to come home again. What a huge responsibility. I wonder if Joseph ever lay awake thinking about it. There he was, an ordinary man acting as father and protector to God's own son. How would he ever manage to do the job right? You may think much the same thing about some responsibility that God has saddled you with right now. How in the world am I going to do this, you wonder? Why would God chose me to handle this situation? I'm just ordinary. And of course, you are right. But God is right too, because he puts his Holy Spirit within you to strengthen and to guide you. He knows your weaknesses, and they are exactly why Jesus came to be your Savior. He knows that you cannot do anything on your own. But he also knows that with God working through you, amazing things can happen. Trust in him. Fold your hands and bow your heads and pray with me. Father, keep me and help me with the work that you have given me to do. Amen. Okay, that brings us back to the answer to our trivia question. The front part of the, step, the sentence from Old Testament scripture was, as for me and my house, and the remainder of the, of the um, sentence is, we will serve the Lord. As for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Joshua 24, verse 15. Okay, let's wrap up our podcast with a reminder about Zion's various media ministry offerings on YouTube and Facebook. Tuesdays is Lessons from the Garden with Garden Granny airing at 9 a.m. and archived after that. Every Sunday, catch the live stream of our worship services on Facebook Live at 10 a.m. Each service will be archived for future viewing on Zion's Facebook pages, as well as uploaded to our YouTube channel. And also this podcast, Casting for Christ, airing each Wednesday beginning at 10 a.m. and archived after that. This is Pastor Greg with Casting for Christ, encouraging you to walk with light, the light of Jesus Christ. We will meet again next week. God's richest blessings for all of you in this new year of our Lord, 2021.